David Roth popularized the idea of using blank coins for magic instead of, let's say, copper coins. So you could do any spellbound move with this. This is more logical and it can be used to turn a blank coin into any coin because that's really how a lot of companies make coins. They make the blanks first and then they stamp the image on it. And that patter can be used for magic. Uh, one of my favorite things to do is to, uh, to hand them out for examination and explain that this is how coins are made. First they made the blank coin and then they stamp it with the image. And then I, I offer to explain by just giving a little rub to the coin you see the head appears. And by rubbing it on the other side the tail side appears. And of course I like to give these coins out as souvenirs at the end. Because it's reflective, uh, you can sh use it to do twilight type routines. So if you put a coin in front of it, it looks like two coins. And that's the pattern you can use. You could take the coin and say, look, doesn't it look like you have two coins when you rub it together? Because there really are two coins. The other nice feature about these mirror coins is they can also be used as a shiner. Let me show you what I mean. The nice thing about these custom-made mirror coins is that they're the exact same diameter as a U.S. half dollar and just a little bit thicker because of the ridge. But you can use this to do any kind of magic you like. Just carry it with you and you're always ready.